Please welcome the one, the only, Michael Hark! <laughs> Staying late, nobody works tomorrow, all right? <laughs> we're good, we're good. Well, we're going to have a good time tonight. How many people have seen a lot of the magic over here uh, in the other rooms? You seen that? Yeah. Did you see the big show next door? Yeah. Yes. It's really a good, good. warm-up for this show. <laughs> no, it's a great show over there and all around the castle. Uh, you know, it's always good to know how many people have been here before. Oh, yeah. And, and more importantly, how many here for the very first time? Yeah. How many would rather see magic than answer stupid questions? Yeah. 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 your hand. Okay. <laughs> you know, the magic I'm going to do for you tonight is classic magic. It's magic you may have seen a, a form of before, but we're going to do it a little differently. Now I'm going to borrow some ordinary objects from your purse or your pocket, which you don't have, I have up here. <laughs> uh, borrow um, some of you from the audience. That's sort of what the front row is for. Yes. <laughs> but many of you might come up here. Those in the back too. So you know, there's a uh, a lot of symbols of magic. There's what a rabbit, top hat, a deck of cards, pieces of black silk. That's from six of you. That just <laughs> <laughs> Let's use this piece of silk to create another symbol of magic. See, it's black on this side, blank. Black on this side, blank. Now tell me, what's black? About this long. Keep it clean. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's Saturday night. It's the, and it looks like, and it's usually made of wood. It has gold, silver, or brass tips, and it's called the magic wand. wand. The magic wand, good. It kind of looks like a magic wand, huh? Yeah, kind of, uh-huh, not bad. But I don't use a magic wand. No, because it's a rather old symbol of magic. So instead of the magic wand, I use, and I'm so excited about this, it's my own invention. Not the magic wand, but instead, oh boy, I use what I call the magic wad. <laughs> so, wave it over things. It's better than a stick, don't you think? Oh, yeah. Okay, well, I need someone to be the keeper of my magic wand. I mean, who doesn't? But uh, before uh, I asked someone to help me with that, who brought the ball of yarn? <laughs> okay, I said I have it up here. We'll use my ball of yarn and my magic wand. Do you want to help me with this? You can sit right there. What's your name? You can sit right there. What's your name? Krista. Huh? Who? Krista. Krista. Uh -huh. Yeah? Huh? Okay. This is called the... <laughs> this is called the... This is called the... Magic wand. Uh -huh. Now, when you talk about the... Magic wand. I'd use a nice, loud voice in respect to the... Magic wand. Uh, so would you hold on to the... <laughs> magic wand. Because you can help me with the magic tonight. With the... Magic wand. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, you know, I know you've seen a magician take a string, rope, cord, cut it, put it back together again. Mm -hmm. Something like that. Well, we're going to do that a little differently. I'm going to use this ball of yarn. And you can help me with this, if you would, sir. Just uh, hang on to these scissors. And let's give the... Uh, let's. Yeah, cut it right there. Somewhere in there. Yeah, doesn't matter. Okay. Now, you know, when I see magicians do this, there's usually a lot of loops, a lot of knots. You're never sure if it's really cut into two pieces. But tonight, let's do that. Let's cut it into two pieces for sure. Give it a cut there. Now I'll take these back from you in case you don't like this trick. <laughs> now, no question about it. Cut into two pieces. There's a long piece, short piece. Now, there's two ways I can put this together. I can tie it together. Or I can put it together by magic. Now watch. I'll use the method that works best for me. Watch. Tie it sucker together. <laughs> <laughs> works every time for me. Oh, shut up. <laughs> oh, I know there's no magic because we didn't use the magic wand at all. Now watch. Now if I can't be good, I can be neat. Let me trim this up. Here. <laughs> Better? Yep. Huh? Yes. Am I getting a little better? Yes. yes. And then we're eventually going to get to the... Uh -huh. Now, take the... Magic uh -huh, And just wave it over the yarn, especially the, the knot. Yeah, we got, a, we got a thing going here. Go ahead, wave, wave it over the... Yeah, there you go. It's like you've done this before, huh? There you go. There you go. Oh, watch. You saw it cut. You saw it tied. Wow. 
believe it. <laughs> so you, you're going to see more shows after this? You're going to stay late tonight? Yes. Yeah. I love a late crowd. Yeah. Not being late for the show, but I love a late <laughs> staying crowd. You like card tricks? I don't either, but... <laughs> yeah, you, you can't come to Magic Castle without seeing at least one. Now, I know you've seen a magician say, hey, you pick a card, I'll tell you what it is. Well, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to ask you to pick three cards and I'll tell you what they are. But we're going to use a little mind reading because I have a little mind. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> uh, let's, let's try this. Let's, let's choose uh, three cards. And I'd like for someone near the front, someone near the center, and then the back. Uh, choose those three cards. So let's start here in the front. And will this gentleman help me here? Of you can course. sit right there. Yes. Just use your hands as a table. Just give the cards a cut. You know, just cut half of them over to the other side. Now we'll mark the cut here now so no one will think he's working with me. I'll go to this guy who is. Just take a look at it. Don't let me see it. I'm turning my back on it so you can take a look. I don't want to see it. Do you have it? Got it. All right, now I'd like for you to choose the person that will choose the next card. Fair enough. Not sure. me. Here's the way you do it. Hold on to this with your throwing hand. Set your throwing hand. All right, in just a minute, I want you to throw it to s s uh, pretty much over your shoulder. No, no, uh, no. Okay, okay. Yeah, see? Right. At random, right? So I, you choose the person I don't. So you throw it over your shoulder, whoever's head it bounces off of, whoever catches it. <laughs> that's the person who will choose the next card. Fair enough? Fair enough. Get a nice, strong throw toward the center of the room. One, two. Perfect. Oh, All right. You just stand right there. I'll come this way. Now, uh, you, you, who, who's helping me? Which one are you? Right there? Okay. Now, as I run through these cards, I want you to notice two, maybe three cards. Okay? You'll eventually settle on one. But just try to remember, memorize two, maybe three cards. All right? I'll run through them again. Right? <laughs> you have a couple or three cards in mind? You will eventually settle on one. You got a couple you can remember there? Okay. You have a piece of paper? Good. You do this for me now. Just give it a toss over your shoulder and somewhere near the back row. One. Okay, that lady there. You don't have to pick up the paper. That's just to mark someone who's going to help me with this. And who found the who found the piece of paper? Okay, this lady right here. Now I'm going to make this even more difficult. Three cards were chosen here. A card was chosen here. Now I want you just to think of a card. Now there's no jokers in the deck, so just think of one of the 52. Okay. In fact, think of maybe two, maybe three cards, but you'll eventually settle on one. Yes. What we're going to do here is a miracle. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and here's the way it works. I have a large deck of cards that matches that regular deck. Now, this is so everybody can be in on this, not just the three people that chose a card, so everybody can see what's going on. But here's where the magic happens. As I call on each one of you individually, this gentleman here, this gentleman here, and the lady in the back, I want you to send me your thoughts. You'll have maybe two or three cards in mind, but send me that one card, that one thought. Now, here's the magic. When you send me that thought, the moment that you send me that thought, I'll remove that card from this deck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's start with the late. Uh, we'll eventually write it down up here, by the way, just so you won't try to fool me and change your mind, okay? But not just yet. Let me remove the card. Okay, on the count of three, just send me your thought. Don't call it out. Are you ready? The lady I'm ready. in the back? I'm ready. This is impossible. This is just right out of your mind. <laughs> okay. Here it comes. On the count of three. One, two, don't call it out. Three. Okay, I removed a card from the deck. I can't take it back. I can't put it back in. I've made my choice. This is it. But you could still be changing your mind. I mean, who would know? <laughs> so for the first time, tell everyone what this card is. Is it the, the King of Clubs? It's whatever you thought. <laughs> yeah, the King. It, what is this card? The King of Clubs. You are correct. <laughs> <laughs> We're building to something here. Okay, the King of Clubs. That's right. <laughs> Uh, this gentleman here. Are you ready? On the count of three, just send me your thoughts. Okay. This is impossible, what we're doing. You know that. Yeah. It's historic. Okay, on the count of three, just send me that call. One, two, don't call it out, three. Okay, again, I removed a card. I can't put it back in. All right? See? I've taken it out. 
now in Out of Your Mind. So tell everyone what this card is for the very first time. It's the Ten of Diamonds. Yes, it is! Very <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, the Ten of... This is a diamond. Come on, this one. There it is. Okay. Am I the only one really excited about this? <laughs> Okay, sister cards say no. No, no. This could be any one of these <coughs> cards. Let's try this. Are you ready? Let me count of three. Just send me that thought. One, two, again, don't call it out. Three. I received it. I removed it. And I remove it. And then tell everyone what this card is. Ten of clubs. Yes, sir. <laughs> it is the ten of little puppy dog's feet. Hey, thanks. <laughs> oh, you expected something more. <laughs> Wouldn't it be amazing if these three cards that I removed from the deck at the moment that you thought of those cards were the very cards that were in your mind and we eventually wrote down? Wouldn't that be a miracle? Yeah. yeah. Let's try that. Let's start with this gentleman down here. That last card, you said it was the Ten of Clubs. I removed this last card for you. At the moment you thought of it, to the pups. Just a little bit here. You sent me a thought. I removed a card at that moment. I didn't put it back. It was that card that you sent me. You said it was the Ten of Diamonds. I removed that second card, the Ten of Diamonds. You merely thought of a card. You didn't think of their cards. Almost, but you didn't. You could have. But you sent me one thought. You said the card was the King of Clubs. Would you believe the card that I removed as you thought of it? No. What a great group! You see magic, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. Well, I'm here to show you. <laughs> Would you like to see some sleight of hand? Yeah! Actually, you already have, you just didn't know it. <laughs> <laughs> no, Otherwise, what would you do sleight of hand? <laughs> <laughs> hey! We didn't use the... Magic wand! ...at all that time. <laughs> Why don't we try something, okay? In fact, uh, uh, I don't usually do this. I usually let you have that as a souvenir. But why don't we try something with that? All right? This is the Ten of Clubs. And why don't you come up and help me? Give her a hand. I'm from North Carolina. Pick one? North Carolina, really? Uh huh. I'm standing in a hole. <laughs> no, you look beautiful. You look beautiful tonight. You want to help me with this? I do. Okay. Now, here's what we're going to do. You've held on to the magic wand all night. All this time. I'm going to cause this ten of clubs that was chosen over here to leave this deck and materialize on that magic wand. Uh -huh. So if you would take the magic wand and just hold it just like that, just by your finger, you don't know where it's been. Hold it just just, <laughs> and just lay it on top of the card. Just lay it on its side so it'll, it'll stay there. And watch. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. The magic happened, didn't it? Oh, <laughs> watch. Remove the. From the car. And look, the ten of clubs is gone. Ooh. It is. And would you believe on that piece of silk, formerly known as the magic wand, uh -huh, is actually now. Yes, the ten of clubs. Oh. I only have two effects I'd like to show you tonight that I have left. I'd like to borrow a lady from the audience who has a ring and a jacket and is willing to come up and help me with those. Not, uh, just a ring, not one of those big Orange County things. But just a little ring. Any lady have a nice little ring and a jacket? This lady here? Do you have a jacket? Yeah. Do you have a nice little, light, little, I don't want to be too responsible. That's one of those big Orange County things, right? Is it a nice little ring? Yeah. I mean, Sure, come up and help me with this. Yeah. 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 Hi, and you are? Sarah. 
Hi, Sarah. Where are you from? Santa Monica. I thought you were going to say uh, Orange County. <laughs> <laughs> let me see your ring. Great, you don't mind if I, is that one ring? Yeah. Wow, that's beautiful. You don't mind if I use that, do you? Okay. Wow. <laughs> but I am going to use your jacket first, okay? okay? And you're going to help me again with this. Come yes. on. Yes. I love this part of the show. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> All right. Just take a half step that way. Good. And half step this way. We won't use your ring yet. We are going to use, is that your jacket or his? His. Okay, good. I like that too. That's good. Now, will you hold on to this side? You don't mind, do you? Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Good. Yeah, okay. <laughs> You hold this side, you hold this side, <laughs> and you hold your breath. <laughs> I'm going to use this piece of paper, this jacket, and this knife. <laughs> Watch, where's the knife? Nice. Through the jacket, and then through the paper. Through the jacket first, and then right through the paper. We having fun or what? Yeah. <laughs> You're smiling, it's not your jacket, is it? Watch, through the jacket first, and then right oh, through the paper. Oh. Oh. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. <laughs> 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 what you think about it, it's not that amazing. I just switch the knife through. There's no magic on it. Stick the knife through. Why am I clapping? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Take care. Not that bad. Let's make this your summer shoot. Sure. May I pass it back to him? Sure. Okay. May I do that? Can I give that to you? Oh, this gentleman back here. I thought it was this guy here. What do I know? <laughs> you know what? Let me just put this right over here, okay? That's all right. You okay with that? Okay. I need your ring. Now, I don't expect you to. That's very nice. And, you'll, and it's lovely. And you'll recognize it when you see it again, yeah? Yeah. And I don't expect you to trust <laughs> <laughs> me with this, but I know that you trust her. Yeah. Don't you? He's from North Carolina. And where are you from? Carolina. <laughs> 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 that, connect, that, connect, that connects them now, right? That can, yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Santa Monica, North Carolina. Yeah, that works. Okay, now I'm going to cover the uh, ring with the handkerchief. Now, you, you, you remember the ring, it had a lovely setting. But the setting is, I'm going to let, let that hang down. You just hold on to the ring part at the top. You feel that? Mm -hmm. You have it? Mm -hmm. All right. This is a very important job. It's not like the... It's not it's like not the... It's not like the magic wand. No! Uh -huh. But I it's still an important either. job. Yeah. Very. <laughs> and I have something for you. You can like this. It's the ball of yarn. Oh, you remember yes. that. You can wear that on your finger or whatever. <laughs> 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 and step that way. Now. This is the last thing I have for you. <coughs> what I'm about to show you is real magic. The rest was crap, but this is, <laughs> this is real magic. Watch. Did you feel that? Oh, I got it. Really? Did you feel that? <laughs> Did you feel that? Yes? Yes? Did you feel this? <laughs> 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 the ring that you've been holding this entire time is gone, so give her a big hand. <laughs> and you, you've been standing there in all your Santa Monica-ness. <laughs> uh, I haven't touched that ball of yarn, have I? No. no. If you would step behind the fishbowl and place the ball of yarn in the fishbowl and find the end to that ball of yarn. There's an end there. There it is. Hand that to me. Now, as I walk over here, watch. The ball of yarn tosses around inside of the fishbowl, gets smaller and smaller. There's nothing in there but more yarn. Now watch. As it gets smaller, you might notice that there is something toward the center. And no, it is not a magic rod. But it is, no, don't touch it yet. I just want to show everybody. It looks like what? A small pouch at the end of this ball of yarn. Now, as I move this way, you move to the front and center and keep your eye on this. 
just I want to bring it forward and let everyone see it. Hold on to the bottom of that. Come closer. That's good. I'll just look there as I look and let go of it for a moment. Just put it down. You see, it's a, it's a small pouch held together at the top with a rubber band. Nothing can go in. Nothing can come out. If you would hold to the bottom of the bag as I remove the yarn. All held together very nice and tight. Yes? Now, what I'd like for you to do is just to, let me show you my hands. Nothing in my hand, but put it in, my, in the fingers, the bottom of the bag. And take the rubber band off the top. And would you believe in this small pouch is... Oh, wow. Wow.